Hey on. I guess this is just a quickie because I have to go like in 40 minutes. Uh, basically today is my grandma's birthday, so I have to go to another city, catch a bus, catch a train, and get there and like congratulate my grandma and just spend some time and get back here to do some work with people. And all this is like, there's so much I want to say and I guess since this video will be short, I'll just go straight to the point. With a lot of things happening in my life and I had I did not have everything straight because I was giving sessions, I was working on myself, I was working on others and mainly my focus shifted onto helping others a whole lot more than helping myself and with all that like my quality and the way I live my life sort of fell down because I started like living by other people's standards and not my own which was like sort of hurting me uh, unknowingly and by that I mean like you know I was pushing myself really hard like doing 100 push-ups a day, 100 squats a day just pushing myself and every, uh, like every day I would do a session for myself, I would give someone else a session, reading, researching, all kinds of things I would do to grow as a person. And lately, all this work I've been doing and giving out to others, uh, with so little free time that I had left, I was like, I need to chill out and just do something that like doesn't like <laughs> overuse my brain, so, so to speak, because I don't want it to overcook and just like, oh my god, going crazy because of all the work, like, because like non-stop, like, I, I really work a lot, and with all that, I started playing video games, and like, you know, Dota, uh, Dota has a battle pass, and like, Red Dead Redemption, they got into video games, so basically my daytime goes into working on myself, helping others, and doing all kinds of sessions, working on websites, translating, editing, like, lots of things, and like, it's, it's uh, like, it's midnight, and I start playing video games, and then like three hours, take over four hours, like that's not working, you know? So a lot of the time I've spent uh, playing video games, which is not good. Like, I mean, like, uh, it's, great, it's great to escape from realities. It's been really helping me to chill out and just relax from all the stress and different things happening. But at the same time, with, with my whole attention going on video games, my life quality fell. By that I mean I wasn't as productive, I wasn't making more content on YouTube, I wasn't researching as much, and like a lot of things that I was that I used to do to help myself wasn't really happening because I needed more time to chill out and I was playing more video games instead of working on myself. So yesterday I was like working with Rich and we did the session on myself and we just like talked out and I realized that uh, I need to start making changes right here right now so I deleted Dota, I got rid of my games <laughs> Really good, like, you know, making a decision and going straight to the point. I did 100 push-ups yesterday, I did 100 push-ups a day, and the whole thing about the 100 push-ups, I fell out for two months. Like, I wasn't doing 100 push-ups a day because, like, a lot of people were putting pressure on me, like, you know, you're working too hard, you're, like, pushing yourself too much, you know, you shouldn't do that, and other things that were saying, like, were going sort of against me, like, oh, maybe I am, like, doing it wrong, maybe I should not push myself that hard, and I sort of started listening to people and what they say, and you know, yeah, like, maybe they're right, so I tried to start listening to them, and they are right in their own world, but it didn't really work out for me, because even though I took my free time to do whatever seems best for me, to chill out, to take it easy, it wasn't working because I started falling out from my other programs, not just working out, but not doing the research, not doing the other things, not listening to the positive people as much, so, so many things that I used to do every day, and like, you know, just basically scheduling and doing a lot, and just pushing myself, I stopped doing that as much and, you know, even though I'm working on myself and doing sessions, I'm helping others and working on the website and doing other things, uh, it wasn't really, uh, it wasn't enough for me. <laughs> and like, weirdly enough, I'm, I'm that person who's like, uh, I'm watching Gary Vee lately, uh, <laughs> for quite about a few months and watching him, the way he achieves his results, the way he like lives his life is like really inspiring and like, I want a long-term results. Because for example, I can play video games and I'm happy when I'm playing it, but when I stop, I don't feel satisfaction because I want to get back to it and continue. When I'm produ producing something and I'm being productive, like I make a video, I'm, I'm enjoying making videos, it's, it's fun, and I'm, I'm glad I can practice my uh, pronouncing and get better at English, communicating with my audience, like all these things, but at the same time, like, it's a long-term results because like, I might die and my videos might still be up, <laughs> you know, it's just like actually great. So, like, one of them results, and maybe I can actually say something to give people some value in life. And, and some people are, like, winning because of my tips or something, and I'm like, that's great. Like, I gave people something that they could use. That's, that's the best thing I can do. So it makes me really happy, and that's what I want to get back to. So, you know, like, the whole thing, I, it's like, I want to make a, like, public, the, like, disclaimer or announcer or thing. 
because like this is the way to push myself. Like if I tell you that I'm gonna do a hundred push-ups a day again, I'm I'm gonna keep myself accountable for that. And like now you know about it. Like yeah, from now on a hundred push-ups a day. So I did yesterday, I did today, and you know just I need I need to keep pushing it and doing a whole lot more than I used to. Like uh, I need to do more research, I need to do more reading, and like all these things uh, to make myself a better person and to enjoy enjoy my life more. Because, you know, short-term happiness is great, but the long-term, if, if I can not only grow as a person, but give something of value to others, it means a lot to me, and I, I need to do that. So, that being said, I want to get back to another thing, like my grandma's birthday. Uh, no, you don't have to say anything. <laughs> More like, I think, like, the whole thing is just that lately I'm spending time with people that I really love and that I really care for and, and, and about. And I think, like, it's really important for us to say what's meaningful, what we mean to others. Like, you know, sometimes we have all these words, like, you know, we love them, but we don't say it like, oh, they, they know that we love them. But we need to say it again and remind them and say what's important while we still have those people. And, like, that's what I want to do today. Uh, just, like, you know, give some value to others and, and give something of myself that others can appreciate and have and just, like, just know. So, you know, it's like, it's, uh, it's more like, it's easy for me to say, I'm trying to do it myself as much as possible, but don't hold it back. If you see a beautiful person, give them a compliment, because they have, they might have a, a like, really terrible day, and you'll be the only person that says a good word, and it might not be, like, a big thing in your world, but at the end of the day, they will think about you, like, wow, someone, that person actually says something good to me. Like, so don't hold yourself back. If you see someone beautiful, just say, give them a compliment. If you have someone you love, your parents, your siblings, your spouse, you know, your husband, your wife, like whoever, just tell them how you feel about them, give them all your love and just don't hold back. This is like, it's really important. And I think people should know how we feel about them and just, you know, we might lose them one day, which is why we should appreciate what we have right now. And like, this is why exactly when I go to, you know, see my grandma and like, just give my attention and love some, and spend some time and come back and, you know, work with other people and stuff. So there's that, uh, but yeah. I think it's like it's, it's really important to be yourself. Like what works for me might not necessarily work for you, and what works for you might not necessarily work for me. But what's the most the most important thing is that no matter what, we find a thing in, in life that makes us happy. You know, at the end of the day, it doesn't matter what you did and all those things. But if you're happy, that's great. You know, do the work that you enjoy. And and easy for me to say. Some people don't don't have the uh, I don't know situations in life where they can do what they actually want like you know we have a family you have the people that they care of for me it's easy because like oh i actually like somehow managed to uh have some talents some abilities that i can give to others i have some knowledge that others can use and they actually appreciate it so i can actually work the thing out and, and do the thing i like but not, not everyone can enjoy that so i think it's like it's really important to have something that you can enjoy doing and i guess that's, that's my own message for today like i'm just like a short video but I just, like, want to hold myself more accountable and do much more in life than just, you know, like, little things and short-term happiness. So for me, like, I want to push myself more. I want to work out again, I want to do more research, I want to make more videos and give something of value to you and, like, grow as a person myself. And, yeah, like, uh, it's just amazing. Like, seeing how my YouTube channel is growing with all your help and creating this, this amazing community, it means a lot to me. Like, I really appreciate it. And I sort of, I sort of feel guilty about not putting as, as much content into it. Because, like, you know, you were helping me, you were, like, we're growing together, and we we're creating something amazing. I try to get back to as many people as I can, and today, today they're like, I was, it was really productive. Like, you know, instead of thinking about, oh, just chilling in the morning and playing video games or something, or I would just, like, sit down and answer all the comments, answer all the emails, get back to everyone, and that was, like, pretty good. So, like, I'm glad, of, I'm glad that I can push myself and sort of, you know, cut out what I don't need and, like, just find a goal that, that sort of, like, makes me passionate, that sort of inspires me, that moves me. And once you have a goal, like, life becomes easier. So, like, right now, I know what I want to achieve. Like, I want to be a better person. I want to grow, uh, you know, my, my character, who I am, and grow as a person and just become brighter, stronger in every way. And, you know, just, like, all those things. So, yeah, short message. I'll, I'll be going soon. <laughs> so, when I get back, like, maybe I will take laptop and I can start making videos on the way. I doubt that I will do that. I have issues with things in public. <laughs> but that's something to do. Like, maybe... I would actually like to maybe just document myself more and just talk about certain things, but yeah, uh, don't hold back. See, tell others how you feel, like, 
we don't live too long here in, in the physical, here, like we're eternal uh, when looking at the big way, but just be expressive, do what you want to do, achieve your dreams, go for it, and yeah, that, that's my message for the day. So, see when I get back, I'll try to make more videos, and there's a whole lot of topics that I want to cover, like a lot of people have comments on getting out of body, and remote viewing, and entities, and life, so a lot of things and a lot of topics to cover. So, yeah, we'll see how it goes. But thank you for watching, thank you for being with me, thank you for supporting me, and I really, really appreciate you. So, yeah, thank you. Bye.